Hello, I'm Jennifer Bailey and in this lecture I'm going to show you how to input simple numerical data into a spreadsheet and also how to copy and paste them down columns as well as entering simple formula. The next thing I'm going to do is add some data into this spreadsheet. So obviously the hours work may vary from week to week but just for the starting point on this spreadsheet I'm going to put eight hours in from Monday to Friday four for Saturday and two for Sunday. And then I'm going to put a rate of pay in. So I'm going to choose £6.31 and I want that to be the same up to Friday. But for Saturday, I'm going to put in a time and a half rate. So anyone who works on a Saturday would earn t time and a half. So we take this rate of pay and we're going to multiply it by one and a half to calculate what the rate would be. So in order to do that, using a formula, we're going to type equals, and I could use this figure here, £6.31. So let's do that, £6.31 multiplied by 1.5. We push enter to accept that formula. So we now have a different rate, so it's £9.46.5p. And then for Sunday, we're going to put in double time. So we're going to do exactly the same again. So equals £6.31 multiplied by 2. So we now have time and a half on a Saturday and double time rate on a Sunday. Now, in a later lecture, I'm going to show you how to make this a lot more simple. But for the purpose of this exercise, I'm just showing you how to create a formula using a number. So what we need to do now is we're going to have to copy this information down for the rest of the column because every single week is going to be the same. The rate of pay is not going to alter. So I'm going to highlight the group of the, the pattern of um, information we've put in. And then by coming to the corner and to the cross, I'm going to copy it down all the way down the column. And as you'll see, it's the spreadsheet is understood that I have five six pound thirty ones and then I've wanted this nine pound forty six and a half and then a twelve pound sixty two and it's repeated it all the way down this column. So it's a good way of copying a pattern of numbers or formulas down a list. The next thing I'm going to do is we're going to do the hours work and I'm going to do a different technique this time. I'm going to copy and paste it. So I've highlighted the cells I want to copy. I come up to copy here or you can put control C on your keyboard and you'll see it's got this um, dotted line around it indicating which area is going to be copied and I'll come to Monday here and I'm going to push paste and I'm going to repeat this process all the way down the column and you notice I just keep pushing paste I don't have to copy again there we go obviously this one is a little bit long we don't need these last digits so I'm going to just push delete and get rid of those. So in summary in this lecture I've shown you how to add numerical data into your spreadsheet and how to copy and paste it so that formula and formula patterns are copied down a column. I've also showed you how to input some very simple formula. I'm Jennifer Bailey and thank you for watching.